Today's Thursday and we had a late start. I did want to mention that from this last storm from the weekend and this week, several farmers in the lower valley lost their livestock, dairy cows. I think it was about under 2,000 that actually froze to death from the cold, cold weather. And then we had a home in Outlook that actually suffered um, a collapsed roofing, collapsed roof into their home. And the landlord wasn't able to repair it right now, so they actually just close up that room. And now I have a leaking roof. So I stayed home to help and see what we can do for that roofing. Um, I plan to go back to work here in a little bit, but I imagine we're gonna close early. This is mad weather. Stay tuned for an update. I'm going back inside, it's cold. Yeah. I don't think it's that much of a problem. I think it's just them uh, rubber seals. Are just but do you think we need to change it in the future? No. no? I'm gonna look. Okay. Good. Well, first thing I do is I probably cut these fucking trees down. I don't want to cut them. I want to trim them. No, but I'd cut this whole like, side, everything over the house because what's happening yeah. is the snow's falling off of this right here, and this is right where it's linking underneath. Okay. And you can see where all the dirt is, where that water just sits right This here. ain't going to fall, right? No. You're good. Okay. No, you can come up further, but I think this is where it is. Yeah, I think so, too. See where that rusty one is? Yep. And I think that's, it's soft. Right here. But is this proper roofing material? I mean, it's, This, I mean, look. I mean, it's flat, Did you right? see? Look. When you step on there, no, this a, yeah, it's supposed to. But okay. If if I was if I would have been the one to do it, I'd have drilled them up here. That way they're not here in the valley. Yeah. Because when they're down here, that water runs down. Because these seals, these seals only last like ten years. Okay. I mean they don't last forever. The little ones on the screws. Yeah. But I think what happens is that water's coming down and it's sitting right here, and this rusty screw is always in the water because none of the other ones are rusty except for that one. And I bet you that's where it's linking in there at. I mean, those are cheap. I mean, you could do that. You could replace those screws fast. Okay. But I mean, if, if it was to me and I would have been the one to put that on, I would have put them up here on top. Yeah. So that the water couldn't have went into them. That's right. But I mean, like that big church on uh, 97, that All Tribes Church there on the side of the road. Shit, I've replaced twice probably there, all the screws. You just go through there with a drill and a drill bit and just replace, take them out, put new ones in. They only last like eight to 10 years. But I bet you that's, you know, all this snow and the rain and everything's falling out of this tree and it's just sitting right here. Okay. I mean, as long as that, cause there is no gasket there. So it's just going down that hole and it's probably going down just a little bit and it's dropping right into your roof. If it was, I mean, you could buy a bag of them screws for, 10 bucks. So take that screw out and put a new one in. Pretty much. For now. Because I think in the future. Because it's got a dip. Doesn't it? It I looks mean, like it has a dip. Like my fat ass is on it. No, 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 no. But I mean, because they did all this roof all yeah. new. Yeah. That's what I told them, Mark, you could. You Just know, do this section new. Yeah, but it's pretty freaking flat. It's, it's pretty flat to put like Oof. this type of shit on it. I think that's why they put tin. And that's okay, but we just got to um, angle it more, don't we? I don't think Taper so. it? I mean, it's tapered enough that the water will run off, but I think the ice is building up. Okay. And then it's damming it. So I think what you might have to do 
is go buy those, um, they got those heat deals that you put on roofs and just put those heat deals along the bottom so that it keeps it warm so that ice can't build up. Because like this was full of water when I got up here. And yeah. I moved that ice and the, the water's going down now. It's running down. Like this side, see how all this stuff is just sitting here? Like this, yeah. see all this water? All this water right here? Well, if I take that ice out of there. Yeah. It'll escape. It'll yeah. run down. It'll run down. I need to a point, but yeah, the water's starting to run down it now. Once it gets clean, but I mean, I think that's what happened is that ice built up it's falling out of this tree. Yeah, stupid tree. I mean, I love them, but we need to take it off of here. I mean, as long as you could keep that ice, or I mean, even if you replace the screws, it doesn't matter, but the screws are gonna have to, I mean, who knows how old it is. Yeah. I mean, it ain't bad, and it wasn't done like wrong. Okay, okay. I mean, I just think that's just, it's just kind of a freak fucking deal, but that's the only one up here that's rusty, is this one. Yeah. And that's pretty goddamn close to where it's Lincoln. Yes, it is. It's about eight feet in. Mm-hmm. So if it were me, what? What happened? Let's... I'm kidding. <laughs> Yeah, there's a lot going to come down right now. Go ahead, Stan. <laughs> yep. You got it? Yeah, babe. You want to go better play? No, it's all right. Just drop it. Yeah. Looking good. On top of the freezer? <coughs> huh.